I am delighted to see more and more focus on the tear film, ocular surface disease, and meibomian gland dysfunction in preparation for cataract surgery or cataract refractive surgery. This is an area that I've been um, focusing on for a very long time and one of the tools that I use is the OPD3 to give me all the various maps that help me not only diagnose pre-existing ocular surface disease but also demonstrate it to the patient. I look at axial maps so I can look at the type and symmetry of the astigmatism. I look at the placido disc image to look at the clarity of the Myers. If the Myers are irregular, warped, kind of missing, I show it to my patients and demonstrate to them that they have pre-existing ocular surface disease which has to be treated before we do any of their preoperative measurements. Without the OPD3, I would not readily be able to have access to all of this information in about 10 seconds.